see you, girl. Hey. Sometimes you gotta let them know. Uh. Listen. Touchdown for my late flight. Great fight. Pack it out with an eighth flight. Hello curls, it's Yolanda Renee. How are you doing? Today I'm coming to you guys with my first trim. So I've never trimmed my hair. I big chopped um, April or May. <laughs> April or May 2012. Um, all you're going to need is some scissors. These are actually um, hair shears that you use to cut hair um, and these are nice and precise and sharp so you know you don't have split ends like we're cutting off the dead ends so our hair can be healthier um, so you definitely want some nice scissors you don't want to make a mistake and use doll scissors or um, scissors that are not meant to cut hair you know what I mean um, I also have this new tool And I found this at Walmart. I think it was maybe five to ten dollars. I can't remember. Um, so we're gonna be using that. I also have a wide tooth comb. Um, I have a water bottle just in case um, I may need to spray my hair, but we're going to really try to do this on dry hair. Although, you know, we shouldn't really detangle our hair while it's dry, so that's why I do have some water um, nearby. And I also have some, um, the main choice doesn't get much better than this. Um, and this is avocado and mango blend. And this is a butter, basically. Um, so this will also help so we're not just detangling our hair, um, you know, without anything on it. So I figured this would help with it. As you can see, my hair is stretched. I bunned my hair. I just used a goodie hair band and kept my hair in a bun. So we're going to take a section. So I'm going to put a little bit of the, the butter on my hair. So I'm just gently detangling. I hear that when you do it wet, um, you end up cutting off too much hair. So that's why I decided to do it on dry, stretched hair. This section is detangled, and now I'm just trying to really smooth it down. And I probably need to cut a lot off, but I'm going to try to keep as much length as possible. So I'm just going to smooth it down. And I already see, I'm probably going to go a little bit longer, probably about here. So I'm going to just cut that off. So that's how much I cut off. So I'm gonna go ahead and twist that part. Just so I won't cut it again, you know what I mean? Again, I'm detangling, and so far I don't really feel the need to put any water on my hair because because it was stretched, it's pretty much detangled, so I'm not really worried about putting stress on my hair. So again, I'm smoothing the hair down. Honestly, I don't even feel like I really needed a trim, but I'm about to start using vitamins, so I figure I might as well do it before I start, and yeah. I'm not 
So I'm just going to do a few more pieces and then I'm just going to finish up and then we'll come back in so you can see the frill, the difference between the frill. Um, it's more like a dusty. Here people use that term. Cause you're the trophy girl that I'll be winning, winning Girl, cause you know, you know, you know Alright Carol, so we're all done. I just trimmed all of my ends or you, I could say dust my ends because I didn't like cut my hair. Um, this is how much hair I cut off. What do you guys think? <laughs> this is so cool. So I feel like I feel like it is more even now. Even though it's so easy to manipulate our hair to look even, I feel like it is more even um, because I would look in videos and I would definitely be able to tell that one side of my fro was longer than the other. So yeah, I feel really good right now from this trim. I'm not going to get scissor happy. I'm not going to trim often. I wanted to come to you guys with this video because one, um, I wanted the video for you guys because um, as you guys know, my videos are pretty much the same styling and all that. So I wanted to come to you guys with something new and fresh and a lot of people ask for trimming videos. So I wanted to do it for you guys and I wanted to do it for myself because I'm about to start Hair Affinity Vitamins and I wanted to make sure that I started fresh on some nice trimmed hair so I can really see the growth and everything. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you have any questions, please leave them below. And again, this was my my way of trimming my hair um, there's so many other techniques I know mahogany curls um, she um, she twists her hair and then cut the ends of it she does the curly girl method of trimming and then also natural 85 she does um, a, a technique on wet hair um, so she basically she soaks it with conditioner first she does not twist the hair but she soaks it with conditioner first and kind of smooths it down and then cut it but this is on dry hair um, like I said there's people who think it's best to do it on wet hair and some people who say on dry hair they say dry hair because you can see the length and you can see how much you're cutting where if your hair is wet your hair swells and it shrinks so you may end up cutting more than what you want to so um but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video and like i said if you have any questions let me know and i'll see you in my next video goodbye girls so she popular with me no bobby and whitney we more like martin nicoretta king usually avoid the hate we in the better things but you know about the drama that the cheddar brings matter of fact baby you made me want to say who's trying to try to find some game i just got just want your routine